Hello and welcome back to Nutfi Plays Paper Mario. So this kind of started without my say so, so yeah, here we go. Oh yeah, Kambi Kuba has to make weird mouth noises all the time because she's old and has dry mouth. I I'm not sure. Mighty King Bowser, I've been looking for you. I don't remember anyone's voice, so bear with me. A report to your evilness. Mario defeated the Goomba King. He's heading for Toad Town now. What? Unbelievable. What was Goomba King thinking? Shit, sorry. <laughs> I used the Star Rod to make him a king because he begged me, and Mario whips him so easily. What a wimp. Uh, Kami Koopa, you are sure that Mario can never defeat us, right? Please, please, your violence, try to be calm. Koopa King is small time. I had a feeling he'd fail, which is weird, because considering that, I don't know why we promoted him. That just kind of puts a whole flaw in our chain of command. Anyway. It doesn't matter, because while you hold the Star Rod, you are definitely invincible. You could beat Mario with one claw tied behind your back. Yes, yes, very good. <laughs> I don't know what that was. I'm sorry. By the way, Kami Koopa, those Star Spirits we captured don't have any way of giving Mario the power, do they? Please, don't worry yourself. He just held it separately. <coughs> Excuse me. And he just carefully guarded by your hand to pick the subjects. Even Mario can't save all of the seven star spirits. <laughs> Who's the closest star spirit to Mario? It's that one at Koopa Brothers Fortress, right? If Mario somehow reaches there, can the Koopa Brothers defeat him? King Bowser, you mustn't worry. Oh shit, what's happening? Yeah! Oh god, what the fuck's happening now? Oh, it's these douche nuggets. Here come the Koopa Brothers. I don't know how to... <laughs> oh yeah, we're the coolest of the cool. Psst, Kami Koopa. Are you sure these guys can get the job done? That Goomba King was gigantic, and even he couldn't beat Mario. Pshaw, get real King Bowser. <laughs> yeah, the Goomba King was huge, but he was a total Wimbola. We're nothing like Wimpola, what the fuck? Screw that last line, what? <laughs> See, what we've got going is the power of teamwork. <laughs> well, that's corny as shit. Together, we can put that <laughs> together we can put the herd on Mario in seconds flat. Get it? It's a paper joke. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Excellent! That's the spirit! Sell it, Koopa Brothers. Show our king that special attack you do so well. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Ready everybody? Take off your clothes. Ooh. That that ooh. Okay, this act- I shouldn't have said take off your clothes, that sounds really weird considering. Anyway, how do you like- how'd you like it, King Bowser? How was it? Oh yeah, excellent. Really, I'm not easily impressed either. Mario won't have a chance if you finish him with that attack. <laughs> we'll take him, King Bowser. By the way, my Koopa bros, about the captured Star Spirit I've locked up in your fortress. Who's guarding him right now? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, nobody, sir. You know, we're here, and so... Idiots! Use your heads. Get back to the stuff for the... Uh, <laughs> you know what? You're gonna have to read that one, because I... I don't think my mouth had a seizure for a second. Anyway, yay, back to video game. God damn it, I keep hitting my microphone. I'm sorry. Anyway, here we go. Do, 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 do. I don't know where I'm going. I don't remember anything about this game. It's been a while. Holy shit. What the fuck? You got the sleepy sheep. It worked. If it works, it makes all enemies sleep for a little while. Oh, that sounds useful. I never use items in this game. I don't, like, actually, any RPG on the planet I've played, I always avoid using items. I don't know why. It's either because I feel like they're cheap, and it's like, oh, hey, I got that. I don't want to use the item because it's like, I'd rather defeat them with my own character, or if I feel like it's such a rare item, I want to save it until the last boss. And even when I get to the last boss, I'm like, no, I don't need it just yet. I can hold off. And they're like, oh, I beat the boss. There are the credits. Cool. I'll never get to use that item now. That's just always been my complex. It's weird. Anyway, Ma Mario, I'm so glad you're okay. The town is in an uproar. The princess kidnapped. The very castle uprooted. It's Bedlam? Bedlam. I really don't know what... I don't really know what we can do about all this. Please, Mario, save her highness. Again. What do you mean, please save her highness? That's what I was already on the, like, my fucking way to do. That's what Mario does. Because Princess Peach's dumbass can't hire good security. Yeah, you've got Toad's... Congratulations. Toads can't do shit. Why not actually like hire like an actual guard with guns? Yeah. Get some of those like 
English, uh, gun guards with the big fuzzy hats. That way they know you're not fucking around. Those dudes are terrifying. They have no expressions, and they're just like, holding a gun, staring, dead-eyed, ready to kill. And you get those, like, placed all around, like, the castle, and Bowser will be like, you know what? Don't wanna deal with this shit right now. And he won't. I assume I'm going the right way. I'm pretty sure this is where I need to go. Oh shit, dramatic change. Oh, I completely forgot what I was talking about. Anyway, yeah, fuck Peach, she's dumb. I mean, I hate Peach, let's be honest. So far, all I've seen her do is get captured and be annoying and be an obstacle. I guess she does provide a reason for the Mario games in that there needs to be some sort of object objective, but it's like she doesn't seem to do much in the ways of usefulness ever. I mean, I guess at the end of Mario 64, she baked a cake. That's cool. Anyway, here's Ghost Spirit Star Man. Let's go. Welcome, Mario. I can't voice act. Welcome, Mario. We've been waiting for you. <laughs> oh, shit. We're the seven star spirits. I already knew that. Our job is to grant the wishes of good people from our home in Star Haven, a place high beyond the sky. We're going to tell you something incredibly important. Please listen carefully. The other day, Bowser and his followers invaded our peaceful Star Haven. They stole our prized treasure, the Star Rod, which we've cared for since the beginning of time. You're not doing a very good job, I'm going to admit. The Star Rod is powerful beyond belief. It can grant any wish. For as long as we can remember, Bowser has been making wishes like, for instance, I'd like to trounce Mario, or I want Princess Peach to like me. Of course, stars ignore such selfish wishes. I want Peach to like me? That doesn't seem so selfish. It doesn't necessarily mean she has to fall in love with me, just, you know, kind of accept me as a friend. Maybe then they could actually have a dialogue and talk to each other and not have to be kidnapped all the time. But you know what, whatever. Selfish wishes of I want people to like me, or I want people to not hate me. Wow, what a selfish douche. As a result, his wishes were never granted. Because we're assholes. Bowser, that fiend, wanting people to like him. <laughs> when he found out that we were ignoring his wishes, he came and stole the Star Rod so he could grant his own wishes. He seems content right now, mainly because he defeated you and captured the princess. Soon enough, though, I fear he will wish for more, and then terrible things will happen. Oh, so that explains why he's not wishing to just, like, destroy the world, because he's too stupid to realize that he can. Okay. It is the responsibility of the Seven Star Spirits to keep the Star Rod safe and use it properly. Admittedly, we fucked up and didn't do that, but now it's your job to fix it. Congratulations, you're our fucking busboy again. Anyway, you must get the Star Rod back from Bowser and return it to its rightful place. In order to do this, we need your help, Mario. Again. Sadly, right now, you are not strong enough to challenge Bowser. Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> he has made himself all-powerful by making wishes with the Star Rod. He is terrible to behold. You guys are just mean. Once we seven star spirits have reunited with Star Haven, we can give you the power to fight Bowser, even with his newfound strength. With our help, you can prevail. Mario, we are. Alas, we've nearly exhausted our power just to talk to you. Although it looks like we're there beside you, it is only an illusion. I can tell you guys are opaque as shit. We're using all of our strength to communicate with you over a great distance, but even now, our strength is fading. You guys suck at everything so far. So far, all of you have just been like a huge disappointment. We've been caught and are being held by Bowser's followers in different pl uh, places throughout the Mushroom Kingdom. Please, Mario. First of all, you must rescue us. Of course, duh. In order to take back the Star Rod from Bowser and save Princess Peach, we need your help. Please, Mario. You are our last hope, and we will. What was that? Mario, it looks like... Mario, it looks like things are a lot more serious than I thought. I'm out. Fuck you. <laughs> he just bails. <laughs> Do you think the princess is going to be alright? I'm really worried about her. Yes, she'll be fine, because I'll save her stupid ass again. Save and continue. And we're back at the castle again? What's happening? Oh yeah, this is the part where you get to play as Peach, which is weird. S sniffle Oh good, she's sitting in a room crying. Mario's probably hurt. Everyone's in prison. And I'm stuck here in this lush, fabulous bedroom. It's a shame. <laughs> the Mushroom Kingdom will be destroyed if things continue the way they're going. Again. Something must be done. Again! If only somebody could help me. Somebody whose name rhymes with Stario. <laughs> oh hey, it's Bowser. <laughs> My dear princess Peach, how are you doing this fine day, night? We can't tell we're in space, you see. Anyway, it's no use waiting for Mario this time, my dear. <laughs> we're so high above the sky right now. Blaze it. 
<laughs> Sorry, that was the stupidest joke I've ever made. Even Mario doesn't have a chance of reaching us up here. <laughs> you know, Princess, as long as I have this star rod, no one in the Mushroom Kingdom can touch me. You know the power that grants everyone's wishes? It's mine. Isn't that just wonderful? <laughs> Imagine what it's like down in your kingdom. Your subjects must be so upset because the wishes aren't being granted. I mean, God forbid they get off their fucking lazy asses and just make shit happen for themselves. No. Oh, how delightful. They deserve it. <laughs> they deserve it for the way they've treated us Koopas over the years. <laughs> if you know... <laughs> if you know... Want anything... Fuck, I keep mixing up the voices. If you do, you know, want anything, all you need to do is ask me, princess. I can grant wishes. Of course, I'll only grant requests that I like. Anyway, think about it. You take care, Princess Peach. Enjoy your stay here. You watch yourself, princess. You'd better not cause any trouble. She, she does make weird mouth noises. Ah, I guess I'll just be here being useless again. Oh, please, if only, if only somebody besides myself could help me. God, I hate you, Princess Peach. Huh? She's... Oh, good. Someone conveniently came to help the useless-ass princess. I guess she's been more helpful in more recent games, but, like, I don't know. I still don't really like Peach that much. She just seems useless. Anyway. Hello, pr <laughs> Hello, pr Hello, Princess Peach. Pleased to meet you. My name is Twink. Please do not Google that. <laughs> or if you do, whatever. Whatever floats your boat. <laughs> but you're... You're a star kid, aren't you? How did you get here? I came up Star Haven to grant your wish. <laughs> I don't know how to voice them. It's our job to grant wishes, you know. Oh, you came because I wished that somebody would help me. Yay! Here I thought I'd have to do something for myself. <laughs> of <laughs> yes, of course. <laughs> oh, that's just great. Thank you so much for coming. Here's my wish. Go right now and take that star back from Bowser, okay? Think you can do it? Uh, uh, sorry, that's a little much for a novice star like me. Maybe one of the honorable star spirits from Star Haven could grant a wish like that. I'm so sorry. Please, ask for something easy. Something a small star can do. Why aren't you just fucking useless? <laughs> Peach is just super mean. But she doesn't get what she wants. No! I want this! And she just throws up on his face. <laughs> I don't know why she knew that. Then, can you take me away from here? Everyone in my castle has been captured, and I have to save them all as soon as possible, by leaving. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I can't grant that wish either, I'm afraid. Actually, I just got called up to the sky a day ago, so I can't do big wishes yet. It's a shame they sent me, huh? The one in the most desperate need of trouble gets the most weak star. Funny how that shit works out, huh? If I were a more splendid star, maybe I could actually help. <laughs> maybe I could help you, but I can't. Suck it up, bitch. It's it's all right. Don't be sad, Twink. Mario would definitely do something to save us all. He's probably coming right now. Let's just wait for him, like I always do. <laughs> oh, Twink, do you think you can find Mario? I want to give this to him. She just pulls out something gross, like a dead cat head. <laughs> This is a lucky- this is a lucky star, isn't it? Okay, I'll do it, Princess Peach. I'll fly to the Mushroom Kingdom just as quick as I can. Whoosh. Oh, wait, Twink, wait a second. Can you also- Please, tell Mario that. <laughs> if he doesn't hurry up, I'm gonna beat the shit out of him. You know, I'm fine and he shouldn't worry, okay? Can you tell him that? Of course! I'll tell him your exact words, Princess Peach, definitely. Now, don't despair. I'll be back. S <laughs> I'll be back soon, so stay safe until I return, okay? And away! <laughs> I'm not very powerful. All I can do is fly through the empty void of space, through the Earth's atmosphere, <laughs> while being made of paper. I'm not that strong. Mario, where are you? <laughs> I can't breathe out here. <laughs> this is fucking space. <laughs> Princess, you're gonna die out there. Anyway, that was fun and all, but, uh. I guess we don't get to play as Peach Day. Oh well, what a shame. Moo hoo. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. If you liked, commented, or watched even, I really do appreciate it. It helps me out a lot. So, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, folks.